myself uh, dr mukul gupta consultant endocrinologist narayana multi specialty hospital jaipur uh, today we will be discussing about uh, uh, diabetes is the leading cause of amputation foot amputation and uh, how can we prevent it and manage diabetes foot as, as all of you know diabetes is the most common problem leading to hyperglycemia and microvascular and macrovascular complication the macrovascular complications are neuropathy retinopathy and the macrovascular complications are ischemic uh, limbs peripheral vascular disease uh, all these uh, things they cause problems to the foot because foot has muscles has bones has nerves as well as the blood vessels and diabetes affects all of it at once so more than 15% cases of amputation are uh, because of the diabetes and uh, how can we prevent it or uh, uh, what are the main causes of uh, diabetic foot the diabetic foot is mainly caused by the neuropathy that is uh, affecting uh, by the high blood glucose level through several mechanisms then it also gets affected by the ischemia and ischemiopathy and then there are biomechanical deformities in the diabetes foot that leads to the problem so what the problem diabetes foot patients face they have a recurrent ulcer they have a recurrent infections uh, the ulcers get infected most with hazardous microorganisms uh, which are uh, fungi bacteria and uh, at all overall uh, at uh, this uh, there is a inclusion of neuropathy as well as ischemia and all these worsens the diabetes foot leading to the diabetic gangrene and ultimately the diabetic foot amputation so if the patient come with a diabetic foot ulcers how can we prevent these patients first of all and most of important is there are five six uh, things to remember how to manage the diabetic foot first and foremost is the control of the blood sugar the blood sugars they should be tightly controlled in these patients because if the blood sugars are high they are the focus of infections and that can create trouble to the diabetic foot patients and increases the ulcer so how to control the blood sugar this is by giving the regular insulins as well as basal bolus uh, any type of insulin you can give along with it you can give some of the medicines but the best choice of the diabetic for treatment of the diabetic foot ulcer is the insulin the next step is to control the infection and that can be given by broad spectrum antibiotic and after doing the pus culture we can give antibiotic as per the culture reports uh, the most common antibiotic use in the diabetic foot ulcers they are basically uh, augmentin uh, these clindamycin or anaerobic antibiotics and then there are higher generation antibiotics which can be given as per the patient's uh, culture reports the third important part is the offloading part which is very important in these cases the offloading of the foot is important because if the foot get repeated frictions the ulcer will not heal so this is the most important the patient should given proper elevation of the foot uh, uh, advice of uh, orthotics and prosthetics they should be taken properly and they should be advised about the total contact cast or reversible contact cast or the diabetic foot and diabetic shoes as per the patient's need another important thing is the debridement of the wound should be properly done at the first sitting and as well as the regularly the patient should be told that the, the diabetic foot ulcers in the wound should be debrided and all the pus and all the infected material should be taken out if this is not done then the wound will, will take long time to heal and our purpose will not be solved the diabetic foot uh, healing uh, is done by regular wound dressing we can do the dressings with uh, several of the available materials like huge holes and hydrogen peroxide we can clean it and then we can do regular dressings with the tissue growth factors and platelet derived growth factors by all these things we can manage these diabetic foot ulcers and we can prevent these ulcers from happening and prevent the foot from the amputation in the diabetic patients thank you
insights from the world's best medical minds. You are watching the right doctors.com.